Hi, if you'd like to see the kind of groceries I buy on my weight loss journey of losing 128 pounds on the Weight Watcher Blue Plan, be sure to watch this video. Hi, my name is Patty. Thanks for clicking on my channel, Winning at Weight Loss. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. So today I have a collection of three grocery haul videos. I shopped at Meyers, uh, Aldi's, and Costco recently and did not put the uh, haul, grocery hauls in a video. So I thought I'd share them with you today. So it is uh, things I buy uh, when I'm on the, my weight loss journey. So that's what I'm including in today's video. I have Aldi's, I have Costco, and I have Meyers which is a new store that they opened around the Cleveland area. So I'm gonna share my things, some of the things I buy at those stores. So you can check those out. Today I have a quick a grocery haul at Meyers Grocery Store. It's a new store that opened up here. I've heard of it before, but never went to it. And I knew that they had some <clears throat> low point bread and rolls that I wanted to try. So that is why I stopped there and I got picked up a few things so I thought I'd share them with you. I got some sweet corn for, those are zero points to have. Strawberries, always good this time of year. I'm trying this oat milk. This is only one point for one tablespoon. It says it's the oatmeal cookie one. So I'm thinking that you can, uh, it'll make your coffee taste like oatmeal cookies. So we'll see how that works. So one tablespoon I only like to spend one point on my coffee and one tablespoon is uh, might not make this light enough but we're gonna try it because I saw it there then I trying some salsa I have this was buy one get one 50% off so I got a cherry salsa and a pineapple salsa these are one point per two tablespoons so I thought they sounded really good to try and I found uh, the baked Tostitos that I like to have with them. And these baked to Tostitos are four points for 20 chips. So they're, you get a little bit more bang for your bucks. And I thought they would be great with the salsa. Then I got some of these <clears throat> fully cooked turkey sausage crumbles. These are one point for a quarter cup. And I like to make uh, these, uh, these sausage muffins in the morning with them. And they're also good to scramble up in eggs or you could put them on top of pizza. So that's a couple suggestions for this. And like I said, it's only one point for a quarter cup. And then I found some 99% fat-free turkey, ground turkey. This is kind of hard to find in the 99% fat-free. So when I find it, I usually buy some. I do like the chicken also, but they didn't have any. So I bought that. Then two other meats I bought is 96% fat-free ground, fat ground beef. This is the ground beef that I always like to use in any recipes. It's uh, really low in points. It's one point per one ounce, I believe. And it it's just works out well rather than using the full fat ground beef. Then I bought a pack of chicken breasts. These were only, a, let's see, they were $1.79 a pound, so that's a really good deal on these, and I'll cut them up for a few meals, or package them up for a few meals. Then here's the bread I was talking about. This is Aunt Millie's Carb Smart Hot Dog Buns and Hamburger Buns. These were only one point a piece, so this is such a value for your points. I mean, it's great if you, I couldn't find any of my one point hot dogs. I like to get the 97% fat free, um, but I will have them. I'll put these in the freezer. I can use them whenever I want. But one point for each of these rolls, you can't beat that. And that's specifically why I went to Meyers for. Then I also got a loaf of the 45 calorie delightful bread. This is one point per slice. And a loaf of carb smart, Five seed bread that Myers had, this is one point per slice also, and I thought it would be a nice change. And I, cherries are in season now. These are zero points. I love to snack on cherries. Asparagus, always good 
sauteed in a pan, roasted in the oven. A lot of things you can do with them. Good side dish. Then I'm trying some new vegetables. They're called Simply Steam from Green Giant. This one is a garlic and herb vegetable and medley, and it has potatoes in it. This is two points for a, two points for a cup. And these vegetables are lemon pepper vegetable medley, which is one cup for, sorry, it's one point for three quarters of a cup. Now these have a uh, little bit of olive oil in them, which is why they have a little bit of points and they're not just zero point vegetables. But it's a good change to have once in a while. Then more snacks, I got these apple straws. They're made by Sensible Portions. They're cinnamon sugar. These are four points for 40 straws, so you get uh, quite a bit of uh, pieces of the apple straws for only uh, four points. So really, you could just take 20 of them and put it in down for two points. So that way you stretch out your points and still get the taste. Here's another snack. I got another cinnamon and sugar skinny pop popcorn mini cakes. These are the cinnamon and sugar flavors. These are four points for 24 cakes. So you get quite a bit of these also for, uh, for snacking. I got some center cut bacon, which is only uh, one point for two slices. So that is, uh, makes good for breakfast, breakfast sandwiches. It's a lot less fat than in regular bacon. And my last thing I bought was some no sugar added vanilla ice cream, which is 90 calories for two thirds of a cup or three points. And if you mix it with a zero point, zero sugar A&W root beer, you get a root beer float. And that is a good treat. No sugar added and the zero root beer. So that's gonna be on uh, the snack train this week. Choo choo! So that's gonna be it for this quick Myers haul. I just thought I'd share some of the snacks and food that I bought. I hope you can find some ideas for purchasing food for the Weight Watcher Blue Plan. Today I have a small Aldi's haul. I got some vegetables, I got some frozen broccoli, some frozen sweet corn, some frozen mixed vegetables, I got some Clancy's pretzel sticks. These are three points for 42 sticks and they are good pretzels. I got some everything bagel skinnies, they're three points per bagel. I got the everything flavor and I also got some English muffins. Those are three points per muffin. Then I got my favorite stock or stoke coffee. It's a good price at Aldi's. Some mild salsa. I use it in a chicken recipe that is zero points unless you add some fat free cheese. I got some crushed pineapple in its own juice, no sugar added. Baby dill pickles are a good crunchy snack to have around. I got a container of strawberries. They are looking pretty good. Zero points. Then I also got a bag of pink lady apples. I don't have a favorite apple. I just have ones I don't like. But these are a good apple. I got some frozen green beans and some of these seasoned zesty french fries. They're only four points for 13 fries. And there's just this way that you can include good food and not feel deprived because these are some really good french fries. Of course, I do them in the air fryer. I purchased some boneless chicken tenderloin so they're already cut up for recipes and I like to purchase my 96% lean ground beef at Aldi's they usually always have it so I like to get it there 
eggs are a good deal at Aldi's. I got some green onions or scallions to add flavor to food. Package of crescent rolls. I think I'm going to make a chicken recipe with the crescent rolls and uh, mixed vegetables. It's like a pot pie. A bag of fresh spinach. A lot of uh, uses for it. You could put it in salads or or uh, sauces. Two packs of Italian seasoning mix. You can use it to marinate or depends on what you put on it, but it gives a lot of flavor. A couple cans of tomato paste to have for cooking. And last but not least, I got some pizzelles. These are one point per pizzelle. And you can make lots of different desserts. You can put Cool Whip in between them to make a ice cream sandwich or fruit or top it with some chocolate or caramel. And there's just a lot of things you can do with these one point per puzzle. And that's it for my small Aldi's grocery haul. I hope you get some ideas. So today I have a little Costco haul. I got some boneless pork chops which are about I believe four points for three ounces. Another meat I got was an eye of round. It's very lean beef and I'll make those for dinner and that also I will put the points on the uh, video I got these Jones's fully cooked chicken sausages they're only one point for three sausage links so though that is a very good point value I have the fully cooked mini wontons chicken and cilantro and they're really good when you put them in some chicken broth. It's like a wonton soup. And then you could just sprinkle on some chopped up green onion. And it's a really good Asian type of soup. Or you could just brown them in a pan and serve them with a sauce or soy sauce. I got a jar of minced garlic. I like this to use for garlic. It is such a value. It's only $4.99 for 48 ounces. Petite diced tomatoes. I got cans of those. I like to use those in a lot of different recipes. These popcorners, kettle corn, are so good. If you like a crunchy snack, it is 17 chips and it's four points. I would always weigh them out on the scale because you get usually get more for that. And then I always get a rotisserie chicken at Costco. They are so good. Zero points for eating the breast meat without the skin. I got a bag of frozen blueberries, which are good value. They're good with uh, uh, fruit to have with breakfast in the morning. This is my first time trying these healthy noodles, versatile and ready to use. It is one point for four ounces. So oh, it's interesting. You just heat them up with water and you can serve them however you want. If you want sauce, if you want to make them with soy sauce or red sauce. So we'll be trying that. I got these bare crunchy apple chips. I know there's points. They're only apples. I know there's points to them though. I'll put it on the screen. And I got a bag of this cilantro lime rice blend. It comes with red onions, fire roasted corn, and red bell pepper. And it looks like it would be a good healthy choice. It is 150 calories for a cup. So it's probably about three points, but I'll put the exact points on the screen. And then I got these just bare, boneless, skinless, lightly breaded chicken breast chunks. These made in the air fryer taste just like Chick-fil-A. They're so good. Three ounces is 160 calories and that it would be five points. And of course I got my Premier Protein. There's 18 containers in that box. It's the best value at Costco. 
we're on sale today, but I like to have my Premier Protein Cafe Latte with my iced coffee. So that's my small Costco haul, and I'm going to go cook. Well, that's it for today's grocery haul video. Please put a comment below on what your favorite grocery store is to shop at. I know everybody has their favorites, so I just like to see what kind of stores you like to shop at. If you like this kind of video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be notified of every time I upload a new video. Remember, we're here to eat healthy, get fit, and be well. This is Patty, and I'm winning at weight loss. Thanks so much for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Thank you.